There are some age you will get to in life that you, you know that there are some things you no longer need to be doing. When you get to a certain stage in life, you understand that, nah, I think, I think I'm too old for all of this. So guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am Chi Wise. I am Chi Wise. To those of you that just see my face for the very first time, you're welcome to my channel. You're welcome to the Chi Wise family where we exude positive vibes only. Anything aside positivity, trust me, you will not find it here. So do well to subscribe to this channel while we dive into the video for the day. So today I'll be sharing with you guys five major things I feel like I am too old for. Like I have outgrown a partic some particular kind of things in life so the first thing i am too old for is that guys i'm too old for like i'm too old for peer pressure all these ah uh, they're pressing on there because this i don't i don't even know how this peer pressure thing is i don't even care what the whole wide world is doing guy if i can't afford a particular kind of lifestyle or more <laughs> you will never see me there you will not even see me there. I'm even trying to force it. I'm trying to force. So I should now come and put pressure on myself, run faster than my shadow. Omo, you will never find it. I, I think I've outgrown that, that side of me. Like, peer pressure, nah, I'm done. Like, you, I cannot be pressured for you. I can't be pressured. Like, I, I don't pass that stage. Like, I don't, I don't, I don't pass that level. If you say. Person go they do some kind of thing, you can't they push me, I can't they rush myself, I wanna start putting pressure on myself. I wanna be like I wanna start being in competition, unhealthy competition with people because everybody or probably you are buying this particular kind of thing. So therefore I need to look for money by by fire by force. I'm all, <laughs> my darling. Nah, you can't find me there. That's just the another thing I, I feel like I've outgrown is to force friendship for you. Although, I don't think, okay, presently, there's a, there's a friendship I'm, I'm trying to, like, kind of make sure it works. Not because I'm trying to force it, but because I'm led to, really, basically, because there are some people that, you, I'm, I'm this kind of person, I, see, I don't have time. <laughs> I don't have time. Even my mom used to tell me that, me, do I even have friends at all? Although she know few ones around me that she'd be like, ah, she's even sure to enter next time that, hey, you're this person, you're still together, because she knows me. I don't move on, like, I don't have time, basically. I'm always going to move, move, do what, nothing. God. So, now imagine me forcing friendship, as old as I am. He, 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 he's not as if, he, he, the thing is bringing million, million to my account or anything. For real, though, I've, I've outgrown forcing friendship. If this particular kind of friend, I, I am, the good side does not outweigh the bad side. Trust me. I'll let it go. But if the bad side is not more than the good side, oh my, <laughs> you move, no honey. So the, th the truth is, I've outgrown trying to force friendship, trying to force you to talk to me, trying to force you to be my friend, trying to try to put in mo more effort than you are putting in. I will not be, ah, no now, ah. Oh my God, two love me, so I can't force friendship now. What's up? So I've, I'm too old to be forcing friendship. Abba. So the next thing I'm too old for, I would say I'm too old for, is that I'm too old to be proving a point. Or to argue. Like there's some things you will say. Like there's some people that I've met that they just try to boss you. They just try to like, they, they, they want to be heard. They don't want to listen to you. Oh my I allow them. I don't know. It's just me. I, I, I just feel like I don't have that strength to come and start trying to prove a point. I'm trying to tell you this, but you are insisting on this particular kind of thing. My darling, I will let you be. Like, I will let you win that conversation. I will let you win that argument, rather. I'm too old to come and start trying to prove a point to you, trying to see things from my own side of you. I don't have that strength for real. Whatsoever thing you have in your head, whatsoever information you want to pass to me, I would listen to it. Like, I would just allow you win. Instead of me arguing, I'm not not get strength. The time I'm using to argue with someone, the time I'm using to argue with anybody who doesn't want to be, who doesn't want to listen, I'll just use that time, just do something meaningful, something productive to my life. I'll just make sure I cut that conversation short. You are right. Whether you are right or wrong, you are always right 100%. No strength, 
like I've passed that stage to come and start trying to prove a point or to come and start arguing. The thing I feel I'm too old for is that I'm too worried about how I look to others. Like, bro, do I look like I care? As much as I'm comfortable, as much as, first of all, my conscience is cleared, personally, I'm not trying to imitate someone, I'm good. I don't have time. I, I don't even have time to even care about what people think what people think about me. I don't I don't have time to come and start trying to 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 worry about oh god this thing I'm doing this would the person like it or not. My darling, I don't have that time. The most important thing is first of all my conscience is cleared. It's if it, I'm not doing something against my will and it's fine. So the last kind of intertwined with this with my fourth point, which is that I'm too old to be pleasing people. Last time I thought to myself pleasing somebody. What I know I can do, I'll do it. I'll do it to the glory of God. I'll do it to clear my conscience. I'll do it not to not to get this perceived notion of, oh, this person is a good person, this person is this, this person is that. I'll just do what I want to do because first of all, am I doing this? Am I doing this to make people um, to, to make people look at me a certain way or not? Or I'm just, I'm doing it for doing sake. I'm doing it to please somebody. Like, I'm too old to please anybody for real. To come and anything, whatever thing I, I, I do, I do because I want to do it. I'm not doing it because I want somebody to see me as a good person or I want somebody to see me as a bad person. No. Like, I'm done pleasing anybody. I'm done pleasing human beings because... The truth is, you can't even please everybody, really. You cannot please everybody because that sometimes when you're trying to please people, you are trying to like walk on eggshell. You will, you will be, like, you be very careful. You will try as much as possible not to hurt um, this this particular person. Forgetting the fact that you might be doing it to please this person at the same time you're not pleasing this other person, at the detriment of your own happiness. I don't know if you get my point. So I'm just too old for all of that. See. Anything I do, I do because I want to do it. I do because my conscience is cleared. I do because it, it is glorifying God. I do because, like, in terms of helping people, I don't have money. I, I cannot go and steal because I want to please you. No, no, it's not possible. Things are not done that way. I cannot because I want to help you, because I want to give somebody something. Okay, I understand the place of sacrifice, no doubt about it. No, no doubt about it. But at the same time, we should. There's a thin line between sacrifice and pleasing people. See, they, I, I understand the, the side of sacrifice. That there are sometimes I've sacrificed a whole lot for people because I want to do it really, not because I want you to see me as a good person. I don't know. Check get my point. So, then see, I have a whole lot of things I feel like I've outgrown for real though. I just have to pick these five because I feel like they are they are kind of very common and there are things that I've seen, I, I've I've noticed in me that I've 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 left some kind of behavior and all of that. It's not as if I've been pleasing people from the onset, no. But I don't, I'm just putting it out here so that people people know you get because. See, pleasing people is dangerous for real. This um, Bonaboy's lyrics where he said, where he said uh, if you do 99 good, you go remain one. It's true. See, if you're trying to please somebody, the moment you don't, see, the moment you, you, you do a particular kind of, a, a particular thing that is not in their favor, my darling, all your one million and one good thing you've been doing, they will, they will clear it off. So, what's the essence of pleasing people? Just do things um, out of out of you trying to you trying to do them because you did it willingly, not because you had this mindset that oh this person is watching me, oh I want this person to see me a particular kind of way, oh I want this person to to not say I'm a bad person, oh I want this person to like me, oh I want this person oh my you will just die, like see. Human being, you cannot even please them. How do I see me like this? Peer pressure. You argue with me, oh, I allow you win. You suck me, hey, why you dress this way? My darling, it's none of your business. You didn't fund 
my lifestyle. So everybody should mind their business, that kind of thing. So that's just it, basically, for real. In life, that's the, in life, you outgrow some things. You outgrow a lot of things, literally. So guys, we've come to the end of this video. If you find this video relatable, if you feel there are some things that, you know, there are some people that they are now wicked. <laughs> for real. Some people are now wicked because they, they've outgrown being good. <laughs> okay, they've outgrown not being wicked. So they're now wicked. So they're, they're, they're in, they are in their era of wickedness. <laughs> it's part of growth. For real, it's part of growth. So it's part of what you want to do and all of that. So that's just it. So if you find this video relatable or you feel that some things you've outgrown, there's some things you no longer do, just let me know in the comment section. So if you've, watch, if, if you've watched this video to this time and you've not subscribed, please do it to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I beg you. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Do it to like, do it to share. So um, Share to your friends, family, lovers, haters, colleagues, business partners, anybody. Just share this to everybody. See you guys in my next video. Bye. And please subscribe to my YouTube. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you. Bye-bye.